Hi everyone, today let us talk about uh, grammar chapter 7, it is subject and predicate. Let us uh, directly go to our chapter subject and predicate. Now let us see what is subject and what is uh, predicate. Firstly let us talk about what is subject, okay? Subject means the subject tells us who or what the sentence is about. The subject tells us about who, that means maybe human being, maybe animals, maybe any kinds, okay? Any kinds of verbs, it may be. That is the subject. It tells about who and what the sentence is about. That is the meaning of a subject. And the second is a predicate. A predicate means it tells about something more about the subject only. It is not difficult at all. Predicate means it tells about the subject. What the subject? Now let us see some examples of the subject and the predicate. It will not take long, okay? Subject and predicate. Now let us see uh, some examples of subject and predicate. I think you have I think you have known what is subject, is it not? What is subject and what is predicate? From there let us learn about some examples. This is the examples. Wait. I think you can see, is it not? The examples of uh, subject or predicate. Number one, honest, honesty is the best policy. Honesty is the best policy. From here let us see what is a subject or predicate. Subject means it tells about who or what, is it not? Who or what means from here. Honesty will be a subject or predicate. It should be a subject, is it not? Honesty will be subject. And the other is the best policy will be what? It will be a predicate, the remaining. It is the best policy will be a predicate. And honesty will be the subject. And subject tells us about mostly a verb, okay? Don't forget it. And the second example is, I ask her to call me. I ask her to call me. Here we can see what is a subject and what is a predicate. Now, I ask her to call me here, who, what are pre, uh, subjects? Subjects will be I, is it not? Because it is a noun, sometimes it talks about a noun. And the rest will be what? Ask her to call me, it is a predicate. I think you can get it, is it not? When we talk about the subject, who or what, is it not? And when we talk about predicate, more about the subject, okay? Then in the second example, I ask her to call me. That means I will be, I will be what? It will be a subject. And ask her to call me will be a predicate. I think you can do it, is it not? You can understand it. And then number three, the three examples, let me give some more examples, if not, you may get confused what is subject and what is predicate, okay? Then the third example is, Lumpi is listening to music. I think from this, you can just see, from the second, the first and the second example, you can see what is the subject and predicate clearly, is it not? By yourself also, you can do what is subject and predicate. Now let us do what, uh, let us underline what is subject and what is predicate. Lun P is listening to music. That means, what is Lun P? Lun P is human being, is it not? That's why who or what? That means Lun P will be what? Will be a subject, okay? Because it tells us who or what, okay? Lun P will be a 
subject. Don't get confused. And predicate means something more about the subject. Is listening to music. Is listening to music will be what? It will be a predicate. Okay. Loon P is listening to music. Loon P will be he, he, he is human being, isn't it? He is human being, who or what? From here also you can see, isn't it? Because of that end, uh, is listening to music, it will be a predicate, okay? More about the subject. That's why you can understand clearly that uh, sometimes a noun come into the uh, equation. You should clearly understand who or what. And the subject tells us who or what, okay? Uh, then, from these uh, examples, there may be others, so many examples in your textbooks also. I request you kindly look into your textbook, okay? Students, please listen it carefully. And you do it. Now, the other examples. Let me just not write down and let me just tell from your textbook. The chef is looking pasta and children. The chef, it is from your textbook. The chef is looking, I mean the chef is cooking pasta at an kitchen. I repeat once again. The chef is cooking pasta and chicken. What will be the subject? The subject will be the chef, isn't it? Not? And the rest is cooking pasta and chicken will be the predicate. Okay. I think you all get it. And examples in your textbook. Please, you can do it now, okay? If you have some problems, you can ask me in the group also, okay? Then today we are talking about subject and predicate. I request all my students, please, what we have discussed from there. If you have some doubt, please, you can ask me, okay? That's all for today. Thank you so much. And if you have a blessed day, thank you so much.